Well, good morning again. How we doing? What? Yeah, got it. Hauling some crap around today. We got our rocks delivered. I'm excited for that. Went and picked up some more fabric. Got some more lights. We're going to get all this stuff a going. It'll be good. Turn you around. There's our pile of rocks. And there's the sun. It sure is bright out. I love it. Pile of rocks we got going in. We got a lot going on. Got our board so we don't break our concrete driving in and out. Should be awesome. There's one! Buenos dias, one! Buenos dias! Morning, Tony! Morning. I'm filming everybody today. <laughs> got my valve, I gotta switch out. Got my lights. Ah, perfect. Alright. Throw this right here. It's a good spot for it. Out of the way. In the pool. Just kidding. See how much work we got done over here. Oh yeah, looking good. A lot of gravel in here. Beautiful, it's looking really good. So. Yay, progress. I love it. All right, so my valves I put in, we just don't quite have enough pressure to run all this stupid soaker hose for more than one planter area. So this one and that one were originally tied together or that one, I don't remember, two of them were. And so I'm going to add another valve over here. Okay. So this extra line I ran, I'm just going to cut that out and it'll actually make it easier. I can just add a thing there. Cut that right there at the valve. And then I'll add another one of these on there. So good thing I ran extra wires. That's why I do it, because you never know. Won't be too bad, just make it easy. Sweet. Got her glued in. Funny thing is with this water, when it's on there, or when the water, when the glue gets in the water, it kind of goes crazy. Kind of fun. Doesn't really mix, but it sure likes to dance around. Oh. It's like little tadpoles swimming around. I got my valve glued in run another drip hose from that end over to right here. We disconnected that T, put a 90, so it went into only this one. And then I'll T into this one. Well, I won't T into it, I'll coupler into this one. Run it into that valve, it'll be all by itself. Tony's over here making a dust storm. Looks good though. Good job, Tony. I got you working hard again. <laughs> these birds are awesome up here. They're just going crazy in these trees. I don't know if they're just building nests or what they're doing, but sure do sound pretty. Where'd you go, little bird? I don't know where he's at. Whatever. Palm tree's pretty anyways. Pretty sky as a backdrop. Man, it's hot today. It'll be probably 90 easy today. Where'd you go, bird? I hear you. Hey, flew away to that one. Cool. Alright. That's all for the birds for now. Alright, simple as that. We just got that drip line put in. Got it all glued, got it all screwed up right there, Teflon in. Looks beautiful. Looks beautiful, one. Love it. 
I just need to put that box back on it, rewire some things up, and we'll be set. Look at that poor little bee. What are you doing, buddy? You're struggling. Come on, little guy. You can do it. I don't know what he's doing down there. Come here, bee. Get out of there. What are you doing, bud? Let's get out of there. Maybe he's attacking that little guy. Now, buddy, don't sting me. Hopefully he doesn't. Come here, bud. It's okay. Come here. We'll get you out. Come here, buddy. He's probably going to be mad. Huh? It's okay. Come here. Come here, bud. Come on. Come on. Get you out of here. Don't sting me. I don't know what your problem is, bud. He's trying to sting me, meanie. Maybe he stung somebody and he's dying. I don't know. Sad little guy. Got her all done. They're being loud. Look at them go. Oh, yeah. Got it done. You'll never know I dug it out again. Minus there's a new valve in there. So that works. Dumping, dumping. Beautiful. All right, we'll see if I can do this with them in the background, making noise. If you can hear me, great. If not, it's all good. You'll figure it out, right? <laughs> all right, so this new valve. Luckily, remember my other video, I wired all these up anyways, just because you never know what you're going to get into. So, what I'll do, these are my wire strippers. Let's go yellow, because I like yellow. I'm just going to shave that off. And I forgot to get any wire nuts, so I will go grab them in a sec. But, we'll get that all shaved up right there. Perfect. And so I'll wire this one to that one. And I'll end up putting the other one in with this white one here. So I'm going to grab some wire nuts and I'll be right back. Alright. <clears throat> Got my wire nuts. We'll wear this wire one, the yellow and the one of these perfect undo this white one let's add another one to it where'd you go get in there so I'm maxed out for these little yellow ones but as long as they all sit in there and stay tight we'll be good I like it. Perfect. Alright, well that's that. Let's go check the other places. Bring my wire cutters. <laughs> so we just got to add... Oh wait, I need my screwdriver and I don't have it with me. Of course I don't have it with me. That's what I do. Run back and forth to the truck all day. Let's go make sure we got a good yellow in here to use and then I'll be uh, set. So, yellow, all right, we're good to go. I just left those in there in case I needed them. I could just plug them in, but I just don't like to because then it thinks that there's in there, so. Let's see. All right, let me uh, go get a screwdriver and we'll just set that right there in number four. We'll be set. Got my screwdriver, so. That was loosed up already, so all I gotta do is uh, strip that wire, put it in. All right, got it stripped. And now I just need to shove it in there. The other way, blue. Kind of hard to do one-handed. Got a glove on one hand. I got a camera in the other. All this loose crap floating around. This is gonna be my first time I've ever done this. It's definitely a possibility. 
All right, I got it in. Hey, and tighten her up. It's good. Okay, now we should be able to test it, but I'm not ready to do that yet because I haven't actually hooked it up to the other drip line. So put those guys back in there. If I ever need them, they're there. I don't, I won't. Lazy and dusty. Here's the moment of truth. We'll manually one. Oh man, it's not even set yet. We gotta set these things. So they're so easy to set. So I'll show you real quick. So you can see I got valve one set for 20 minutes. How well can you tell? I don't know if you can see. I just believe me if you can't see it. That's good. So station two, I'm gonna go for 30. See, these are the soakers. We're gonna soak the crap out of these. So we're gonna go two, three, and four up to 30 minutes. The real question is valve four is that when we just wired in i just want to triple check make sure it's working anyway so there we go let's run see four for 30. so we should have water run it run it run it run over the wire pit <laughs> right here we should have wire water water i hear the water good yeah, so you got a drip going, so we know we got water there, so that's good. I don't know if you can see those little misters misting out of those. So these little silver hoses are like pinholes everywhere. They just leak. <laughs> so we'll get some mulch and bury them all so it kind of keeps it all inside. Oh, hey, that one's spraying me. Huh. Cool. So our valve's working. That's always a good sign. So I'm going to let these things soak. Hi, it's me. I'm going to let these things soak for a while and then we'll uh, go crazy from there. Alright, I'll show you real quick how to do these little lights. They're super easy. Just like that one. Got that one set up. Got to get this thing open. Put the stake in the ground where you want it. If it doesn't go in, I have a screwdriver so I can stab, loosen up the soil or rocks, whatever. There's like a big rock in the way. Get out of here, rock. Should be good enough. Push that down in. Perfect. Point this where you want it. at the tree so it'll light it up at night so point up in the air tighten her down push her down she'll be shining up at the tree let's go all right then I'm gonna set you down right here Perfect. Take these little guys, separate them. Just put them inside your wire right there like that. You see that? Pushes into there. Put this one on the other side and they clamp together. And it has a little stabby inside there. You see that thing? It basically pokes the hole and touches the wire. That's all it needs. together as hard as you can. Clicks into place. Voila. Beautiful. See that? And you're done. You go on to the next one. Follow the wire down to the next one. Here we are. This one we're going to point at that bush. Yay. Super easy. Oh, look, I'm bright. Holy moly, I'm bright. Blinded by the light. Yeah. All right, so our light wires, you may have seen me plugging in over there. Pop out right here, go into this transformer here. 
So what I'm gonna do is turn it on. Listen to this. Sounds cool. Oh, it didn't sound cool. There it is. Made a weird noise. Whatever. Probably didn't really make a weird noise in there, but I heard it. Now we're just gonna make sure our lights work. Are you lit up? Oh yeah. Are you lit up? Oh yeah. Wonder done Fatka, where's the next slide at? It's hiding over here. Light. 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 I can see that one's on. Light. 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 And light. They all work. Awesome. I love when things work. Yay. All right, when we're all said and done, we'll have concrete from here to here. So this will all be concrete. We'll have our walkway. I got it painted out. Match up to that one there. And then this way, we're going to do a little fake riverbed. This is still in concept stage, so I'm pretty sure this is what we're going to try to do. But just bring that riverbed straight through here. Open it up to a little pond. So it looks, there won't be water in it, but it looks like there could be. But it will also help drain everything out of the yard. And these little orange squares, I'm hoping we can do a flagstone walkway. It's off the sidewalk, so it make it easier to get to our planter boxes. So you won't have to walk through gravel. And then we can make a little pretty little bridge over the riverbed figure out something with that and then just dead end it over here right where we got the grass coming in so then we should be in good shape but anyways well thanks for hanging out with us today we got a little bit done oh let me go show you how much they got done so we got the gravel to here yeah i know i'm terrible at ordering i'll take a good guesstimate so we got all this done, all that done, all the way over to there. And this stuff, section here is all good to go, so should be good to go very soon. Now I just need to bring some sand in to compact for the fake grass. And this area is just wanted to get all that done so we're not driving back and forth over it anymore. I can car get that grass going next. And then uh, we'll be in good shape. Getting close. All right, well, thanks for hanging out with us and I'm gonna head out of here. So good to see you again and thanks for watching.